CGR 4M, the environment and resource management. Did you know that the warmest year on record was 2016 until it was matched in 2020? In fact, each of the past six years has been warmer than 2015. It is predicted that this warming trend will continue unless something drastic is done to reduce our addiction to fossil fuel. In the environment and resource management, you will get to investigate the interactions between natural and human systems, with a particular emphasis on the impacts of human activity on ecosystems and natural processes. You will get to use the geographic inquiry process, apply the concepts of geographic thinking, and employ a variety of spatial skills and technologies to analyze these impacts that human activity has had on our planet and propose ways of reducing them. Through the investigation of case studies, we'll examine how resources are managed, about sustainability practices, as well as issues related to government policies and international agreements, such as the Paris Climate Agreement. We'll also consider questions of individual responsibility and environmental stewardship as we explore ways of developing more sustainable relationship with the environment. The last time we ran this course, the class went to Nickel Beach and investigated plastics and other litter that was found. Our findings were published in the Welland Tribune and then taken to City Hall. You will learn research, writing, and presentation skills that will help prepare you for your post-secondary studies. Join me as we learn and investigate how we manage our natural resources, impact our planet, and make it a better place in the environment and resource management.